Okay, so I got a question from Javi. Javi wrote in and said, Yo, Sparty, want to know what you would do in this specific situation. I was recently dating an Instagram model for about four months, and the first three months went great. On month four, I noticed she started kind of pushing my boundaries. And what I mean by that is she, fl she flaked on me one time. And I told her, hey, I don't appreciate that. If you do it again, I'm not going to be dating you. I'm going to end it with you. And she said, oh, I'm so sorry. I don't mean it. You know, so sorry about it. And then what happened was two weeks later, she did it again. It's almost like I didn't say anything to her. And she didn't appreciate me. So I told her, hey, listen, I'm not dating you anymore. I don't appreciate that shit. If you cancel on me, fuck that. I don't want to be with someone who doesn't appreciate my time. And it, what ended up happening was it turned into a toxic motherfucking fight. Yelling back and forth, and it got fucking ugly. Point being is, we haven't talked in about two months. But what I've noticed while we haven't been talking is she keeps posting on her social media stories on Instagram cryptic messages to try to get me to reach out to her. Want to know what you would do in this situation? I haven't reached out to her. I don't plan on it. But... Want to know what this means, your thought process behind it. Will she reach out? Will she apologize? I'm just looking for answers. Just want to know. Peace. Okay, so, Javi, here's the deal. I have dated a fair, share, a fair share of Instagram models, and I don't date them anymore, right? They're not my cup of tea. They're generically, Generally speaking, uh, they are very selfish. They get a lot of attention from other guys, and they let it get to their head. So, for example, in your case where she says... Uh, she starts flaking on you, and you're like, if you do that again, um, I'm going to walk away because I don't appreciate that. She doesn't actually believe you because there's been so many simps out there that are commenting on all her photos, bringing her confidence to, like, to the roof where she thinks she's better than, than all men, right? So um, because of that, she starts to disrespect people that matter to her in her life. And what she needs to, know, to learn is... She's in for a rude awakening when she deals with higher status men, right? So when she starts to disrespect a guy by, you know, flaking on the plans, even when you said, hey, I'm going to fucking end it with you, right? If you do that again, I'm going to fucking end it with you, right? She doesn't know she, what she ends up doing. She doesn't believe you because she's never seen it in her life. Now, what you need to do in this situation is you're no contact till mo motherfucking death. You're not reaching out to that bitch. Fuck no. You gotta give her a rude fucking awakening. She needs to learn that there are people who will tolerate that shit, and then there's fucking me, okay? And if you want to fucking flake on my plans, even after I've said, nope, I'm gonna end it with you, nope, I'm gonna end it with you, right? Then she's gotta fucking earn her spot back in your world, right? She's gotta earn it back. And you're not fucking doing a damn thing. You're moving on with your life, because... If you can score some IG models, there are lots of fucking bitches that are willing to suck your fucking dick, right? So her doing all these cryptic messages is just an attempt for her to be like, I know he's going to reach out. I got to get him to reach out. And it becomes obsessive for her, right? It becomes obsessive where she's, she just wants that validation because she hasn't got it from you, right? So what she's trying to do is she's trying to catch you. She wants you to respond to that story about that little puppy or something. Oh my God, so cute. Remember we did this? That's what her angle is. And then once you do, got him. Got him. It's over. I win. That's her, her, her thing, right? She's just looking for that validation. So for you, in this specific point of view, you're no contact till goddamn death. Until she reaches out to you and until she apologizes, until she kind of follows through, you're not entertaining her. She's gross to you. Disgusting. There are so many other girls out there that are better than that and that's why again it might not be fair to fucking all ig girls not all ig girls are like that but the vast majority of them they're fucking models they get all these compliments and they're they're trying to spew attention and they just are have ugly personalities okay and again not trying to rip all of them but majority of them that i've dealt with in my you know fuck that right i'd rather a girl who's a little under the radar personally because they don't fucking do that shit. And they respect you. And they don't let fucking their reputation uh, get to their head. Because at the end of the day, dude, right? The thing with the, these IG girls and IG models, they spend millions of fucking dollars on like plastic surgery, makeup, all that shit, right? They're not authentic, okay? And for me, I like authenticity in a personality, right? I like someone who's their self, right? When you're presenting yourself a fake version of yourself, 
What does that say about your personality? It's like an insecurity thing and it's just not attractive, right? I like a fucking, it's just, it's just not. You'd rather a girl just be passionate about you rather than, oh, I, I paid for my, my face, I paid for a facelift, blah, blah, blah. You, 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 you gotta chase me. Well, there's the truth. She doesn't fucking respect you when you start chasing her. No girls do. She needs to be chasing you, okay? So keep, leave that in the back of your mind. Let her chase you and never, 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 never give her the benefit of the doubt, okay? Because she that's all she's looking for. She's just looking for that validation. You know what's going to happen when you do reach out to her, if you do? And I've seen it happen before where guys reach out. <laughs> they say, oh, they're nice, and then they stop responding. Cause they're like, I got him. I know I can get him back whenever. I can get him back. I, I hit that, I, I got him, right? When you walk away, you're the guy she can't fucking forget.